Hello, and thanks for watching. This is to give you an overview of all the features in your Science Fusion textbook. Let's start over here. We can go to the contents and look at the table of contents. Uh, we want to navigate to Unit 1 and check out Lesson 1, for example. In the table of contents, it makes you lets you jump out to these individual places and you immediately go to those bookmarks. In addition to the table of contents, sometimes teachers will send you to a specific page. And of course, you can go up here and type in the page and press Enter, and it will zip you right over to that page. Speaking of bookmarks, over here, we can jump up to this little button right here on each page, and we can bookmark those. My suggestion is to use table of contents together, go to each lesson, skip ahead one page with the next page button, and I would bookmark all of these review sections. So that's how I'd use table of contents and bookmarks together. I'm going to do this for lesson three now. Skip ahead one page. And then I'm going to bookmark that page. Then I'll have all of my review items together in one place. OK, let's go forward into a random section. We're learning about erosion here and we have a key idea. So let's take this idea and highlight it. And I want to make a note about that. So I click here and I add a note. It brings me over here and it gives me the text that I highlighted and it allows me to change the color of that highlight. Maybe I use pink for examples, maybe I use yellow for definitions. And I can add more information down here. Remember to press save and you get up to a thousand notes. All right, page view is pretty self-explanatory. Look at one page or look at two pages. In the two page view, you may lose some of your zooming features. In the one page view, you can still zoom. Audio is pretty amazing. They give you a complete recording of the textbook and you can listen to that rather than read it or read along with the textbook. And finally, there's a search feature and this works as you'd expect with a couple other twists. So let's say I want to know more about glaciers. I search for glaciers. I find there's 27 uh, results. But let's say I want to use glaciers and erosion I can add a plus sign at the beginning of erosion. Then I'll find all the pages where glaciers and erosion occur. So you see down here there's erosion as an example. I click on that example and it goes straight to it. Now let's also remember that we have a command F feature which also finds things in the text that you are viewing at the time. So let's say I need an example of how things are similar and it finds the word similar right there and right there two matches on this page thank you for watching and subscribing